today is a day week four day five today is the last day of um the capri curves keep the curves drop the fat challenge we made it y'all we made it the last day man sheesh I didn't wake up as early as I normally did my body was just saying girl you need the rest <sighs> but it's still kind of early so in these final week in this final week, um, Capri has been wanting us to do the stomach vacuum. She's been wanting us to do that um, as soon as we wake up in the morning before we do any sort of workout. So I've been doing that, but I just haven't been um, recording it. But I guess on the last day, I can show you. <laughs> so yeah. Um, Ten of these. So on the last day, I decided to switch it up a little bit and only have carbs for lunch. So um, instead of the pancakes, I just made an egg scramble with uh, egg whites and kale, uh, a little bit of cheese on top, and then that chicken sausage, same one. I just slice it up three ways. Um, I have my glass of water. And I'm reading my Manifest Now book. I've read it before. I listen to the Audible while I'm outside walking. But yeah. We're done. We are actually done with the workout. 
I am proud of myself mainly because usually after a week or two, I'm done. And that almost happened in week three. Um, I still was working out, but like I was overeating and I wasn't um, purchasing food for, well, Throughout this whole thing, I purchased outside food about three times. One was a salad from Chick-fil-A. And um, one was some chicken wings, I think. Yeah, some chicken wings. And then uh, one was chicken wings and fries. And then one was um, cauliflower pizza. Um... The Chick-fil-A salad, I feel, wasn't that bad. Um, But the other two days, uh, yeah. Um, And then I just started, like, binge eating. Not, like, junk, but, like, healthy stuff. Well, semi-healthy stuff that were in the house that I had to cook. But um, I was just so hungry. And I was eating past the time that I was giving myself to eat. So... Yeah, but I caught back up. Um, I I be- I beat myself up a little bit because I was like, had I stuck to how I was in week one and two, uh, week three would have been serious, and then week four, yo, my body would be out of there. Um. So I beat myself up a little bit uh, because of that, and but it's all good because I finished something. And this is a lot for me because I never finish anything. Like, literally, I never finish anything. Like, I'll start something and I won't finish it. And I was committed to finishing this program in its entirety, not skipping a day. Like, no. And um, I did it. Even though I wanted to quit, even though I wanted to give up, even though I was like, yo, this is for the birds. Like, I'm done. (laughs) Like, yo, I'm done with this. I kept going. And, yeah, I'm super proud of myself. Um, So, yeah. uh, I will do um, a review of the whole thing. I will show you my body in picture form before and after and like my measurements. Um, And then we are off to the next um, goal. Uh, And I think this time the challenge will be more so with food related because I know I can do the workout. That's not a problem. It's what I'm eating. And I never, like, I thought portion control and stuff like that, like, measuring my food and stuff, it just stresses me out. Um, So once I figure out, like, what to eat and stick to it, I think my thing is, is, like, for a whole week, I need to stick to one thing. That's what I eat. The following week, change it up, stick to that. That, I think that's what I'm going to do. So, I listen. I had I'm so proud of myself because I had some uh, Trader Joe's frozen like Indian meal things that I was gonna use, and I said no, no shade, no carbs. So um, I was gonna do some chicken wings in the air fryer with some green beans. But I remembered that I bought these at Trader Joe's. These are like orange chicken things, nugget things. Um, yeah, and I just made that, and then I uh, sauteed it in this spicy Korean style stir fry sauce. So that's what I'm having for lunch, and struggling today to finish my water. I still have another one over there that's not even half empty. Struggling. A mosh posh of food. 
sauteed vegetables, we got green beans, we got broccoli, we got mushrooms, we got Brussels sprouts, we got okra, and then... Uh, crash course, let me hide the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the porch? Goofy with the...